What's up, MK fams? Uh, I'm gonna go over some of the patch notes for the current Mortal Kombat X. Mainly, Reptile's Acid Spit got a lot less recovery on it, so that's gonna cause us to be able to get a lot more on screen. Hopefully, it's gonna make the zoning a lot better. We'll be able to get some smooth converts like that. I mean, putting putting the spit on the screen and then recovering fast enough to throw out other moves like dashing up or um, even even being able to spit and then do the enhanced spit and block or, or throw other moves out is going to be great. I mean, if someone's crazy enough to wake up like that, then that's, that's funny. They're going to get... It's going to be punished, but um, a lot of times it's going to allow us to get more on the screen. And I think that's going to be great. Uh, one little tiny buff is that with the puddle on the ground you can't run over it anymore and that just means like when you're running it'll cause the opponent to stop and uh, they can they start a walk animation so that's kind of something that should have been there since day one but thanks you know it's it's cool that it's there now uh, mainly the reason I like it though is because when it's on the screen I'm hoping that it'll cause less people to want to jump over force balls and when that's happening, then you can get more on the screen. You can get more force balls at different speeds and maybe even run in and convert, etc. The flip, it's uh, it's increased in damage some. It hurts 9% now, but the enhanced flip no longer launches. So whenever you get the enhanced flip, you're just going to get a knockdown like that. And it's going to be 12%. But that's fine, you know, that's a little bit more damage and at least it's safe now. We did lose armor on the claw, but that doesn't really matter. Most characters lost their armored launchers, so claw enhanced claws are just going to be used for like combo extensions now. The main thing is with spit recovering faster, you can get a lot more damage out of combos in the corner, especially nimble. It's going to help out a lot. That's a uh, Ford 4 uh, conversion and then um, whenever you do Basilisk runner setups like into the back three it's gonna allow us to convert for a little bit more damage there uh, also the overhead kind of the same way it's like you can go into the overhead after Basilisk runner it's definitely unsafe but it's something to try you know you never know you can catch the opponent off guard go for a mix-up if they're not trying to wake up and I think you know you might be able to get 54 out of that on a good day I'm not sure I don't really care that much. Um, if they are waking up though, you can go for the 4-4 slide and they'll still break a lot of the armors and this conversion is a little bit higher now. Uh, same, you know, if they start blocking low because they think that you're going to do that, you can still just go for 4-4-1-2 and then when you see it hit, you can confirm into like standing 4 spit and this is going to get a little bit more damage than before. Not much, but I mean it's, it's an increase so that's good overall just like buff damage in the corner. Uh, Ilganowski has this combo right here. It's a conversion from back one down four and I really like it. It's, it's awesome but I'm I'm afraid that it's going to be hard for me to do online especially since my internet speed's way worse now. So I may go with this. This is 3% um, less but it's really easy to do. So um, for online play I may recommend that. Now, um, another thing is you can convert a little bit higher from the 4 to one This, I mean, it's expensive, it costs two bars, but with footsies hopefully playing a bigger role, 4 to one conversions are going to be kind of important. So that's 54, 54, I mean, that was 53, I believe, before. Um, I changed it up by adding some more spits into it. Um, another thing, though, that's pretty good is uh, Deceptive lost its armor. Uh, I That's gonna make a lot of setups not work anymore. Um, I'm not sure why they wanted to take it away. It only had a few bits. I mean, I guess there was some there was some dirty stuff, but you know, Deceptive, you can still, whenever Reptile goes invisible in the middle of block strings, you could still option select armor him back. And if you had a safe armor move, then you really make them look you made them look like so dumb so now that the armor has gone I think it kind of puts the nail in the coffin like there is no reason why you would want to use deceptive uh, meter burn slide or slippery slide has a little bit less uh, hit advantage but now it has two hits of armor and, and then there's a universal combo like this thanks to Reverend pop off he showed me this God bless bro um, 
that's kind of a universal BNB now. You could do Ford 412 into the spit because it's confirmable. And then you can do Ford 41 into fast force ball since the um, spit recovers that much faster. You're able to get the Ford 41. But yep, yeah, that's about it. They should have taken a second look at Noxus, I think, even though combos are going to hurt more because of the spit deal. But honestly, this makes Nimble the best. Thanks for watching, guys.